During the past year, I have had over 1.5 million people read my Medium stories, and I have made well over $50,000 with that, and that is all thanks to SEMrush, which is an AI-based search engine optimization tool that finds me these super low competition topics where there are lots of people interested in those. And typically, SEMrush is a bit of an expensive product, but because I like my audience, that is you people, so much, I went out there and negotiated a 14-day free trial that you can activate by clicking the link in the description. And in this video, I will show you exactly how I use SEMrush to find these winning blog post topic ideas. Now let's start with what is a good medium story topic in the first place. So actually it's very simple. You need to find something where you don't have a lot of competition, but where you have lots of people searching for that topic on Google and other search engines. And actually this strategy involves not using the medium partner program. So I've seen that my best earnings and my best moneymaker posts are these ones where I do affiliate marketing, which basically just means that I create a story like this then it ranks on Google when people search for, for example, best AI video generators, then they find this post, they find these products that I recommend here through these genuine recommendations and reviews. And if they click one of these links here and make a purchase, I will earn a reward, which is very good in this affiliate marketing space in AI. But yeah, that's a brief introduction to what strategy I use in the first place. If you want to learn more about that, if affiliate marketing is new to you, or if you want to learn more about my strategies, you can check the link in the description because there you will find a free course where I teach this stuff. But nonetheless, let's continue with the good medium story topic. So once you find a topic where you don't have competitors and there are lots of people interested in the topic, those stories tend to rank on Google and other search engines, which brings you passive traffic. And if the topic is good, you might get hundreds of thousands of visitors from Google passively for months. And also if you do affiliate marketing, you will get passive income. But now it's easy to say, find a low competition topic where you have a lot of searches, but how on earth do you actually know what is low competition and where you have searches? And that's exactly why we have SEMrush. On SEMrush, all you need to do is go to this keyword overview section here on the left-hand side, and then you can type in something, basically you can type in anything, but for example, in our use case, because I like to write these AI related posts, we can type in something like AI tools and then we can hit search. And now this will show you how many people globally are searching for this particular topic per month. You see the competitiveness score and stuff like that. You also see that it's a commercial search, which means that there are people interested in buying something when they read this content, which is excellent for affiliate marketing. So you can do these product recommendations and people will actually buy because if you just have a random blog post where you have this, nobody will ever buy anything from you. But nonetheless, that is not the most important part. But the most important part here is that if you scroll down a bit below, so remember we search for AI tools, we're going to see the section where it says keyword ideas here. And in other words, these are medium story topic ideas. And as you can see, we have 21,000 topics that has a total search volume of almost a million searches per month. So there are almost a million people searching for these topics on Google. And now if I click on view all the keywords, I'm going to see all these topics that are worth considering. So for example, AI tools, AI detection tool. If we go further, we're going to see AI writing tool, diff AI tools, Google AI tools and whatnot. And now here you can choose your topic. So basically these are the topics that you can write a blog post about on Medium. But now you need to take it one step further because most of these topics are too competitive. So if you see a red dot here in the KD column, this basically just means that it is too competitive. So you need to target topics that are either green or yellow. That is preferably like I would say between zero and 50 or perhaps 60 because Medium is a powerful platform in competitiveness. And now if you want to filter out all these difficult keywords, difficult blog post topics, story ideas, you can go here on the left hand side where it says KD and there's a drop down and you can, for example, do a customization range between zero and 60. So this will only show you these topics where the competitiveness is between zero and 60, 
which is still doable on Medium. And then you can obviously sort this based on the number of searches per month or based on the keyword difficulty. But nonetheless, this shows you a bunch of good topics and I use this strategy all the time before I write a blog post on Medium and in a similar fashion I actually use this strategy before I publish something on LinkedIn or for example I make a YouTube video where I do some AI software reviews. So this is a golden strategy for you to find these topics that are actually not too competitive yet they still have a lot of people searching for these. And also something you want to pay attention to especially if you're doing affiliate marketing if you want to get compensated for writing this post basically then what you need to do is you need to make sure that the intent column says c because this means that a user wants to investigate brands or services in other words they're just a couple of clicks away from making a purchase just as an example here we have best math ai study tools the intent is commercial so people want to buy and there are 2000 people searching for this topic every single month and the competitiveness is easy. So this one right here is a good example of a blog post topic that you probably should cover on Medium by testing these tools, by spending like a day or two on this and then joining the affiliate programs and then putting a blog post out. And this is how I find my topics. So basically every single blog post that I write and don't get me wrong, so obviously you can use these other strategies to find blog post topic ideas. So for instance, you can go to Google, type in something related to your topic, and then see these Google recommendations. And these are good blog post topic candidates. But the problem is that you don't know how many people are searching for those topics, and you also can't really tell how competitive those are. And that's what a tool like SEMrush is good for, because it will point out to you these topics that are too competitive and out of your reach, so that you don't, for example, spend two days on writing an article that will never get any reads in the first place. 